U to U to B U to Bia Guna. Does being a football fan give you more joy or more sorrow and pain in your life? You see, I'm an Arsenal fan, and over the years we've had lots of highs and lows, and depending on many factors, my participation in the world of following them has changed. When I think of rivalry, my closest friends are Spurs fans, and we've found that happy medium between when to talk about it, when not to. However, I have heard of friendships being broken by their football allegiances. Then you have the time that you spend following your team, watching matches, reading about transfers or who's coming up or who's going down. I don't know if that's a good thing or not. It's good to have a passion and a hobby, but how does that really build into making you, I don't know, a better person or developing some skills? It definitely gives you stuff to talk about when you're in England. Football is a common topic. And perhaps in some spheres, if you don't know how to talk about football, you'll be left out. But ultimately, one of the best things about being a big fan of football is then actually playing football, creating new friends, thinking tactically, keeping yourself fit, and also having something that you look forward to each week, as you know, on Wednesdays and Saturdays for me. So being a football fan, I guess it all boils down to has it made you active in the sport itself? We love you, Arsenal. We do. We love you, Arsenal. We do. We love you, Arsenal. We do. Oh, Arsenal, we love you.